Hey Tomsters, welcome back. So this video, I'm just going to show you how I got my hair straight and what I used. So basically, I just blew dry my hair with the cool setting to lock in the moisture. So, you know, my cuticles won't be all open and stuff. And yeah, I just did that all over my head. So I really didn't flat iron my hair myself. I absolutely hate flat ironing my hair. It takes me a long time. My arms hurt. It's just very stressful for me. So my friend was actually willing to do it for me. So you see her here. She went over my roots a couple times and then she finished off with a comb chase. And I told her to do that because like she was starting off not with the comb chase. And I was like, no girl, you need to do the comb chase because my ends would not get straight like that so she pretty much did my whole head except for over the front I pretty much did the front because she took an eating break so I just went ahead and finished off the front but she basically flat out my whole head for me and of course it still took a long time I think like two hours or so um, but the flat iron that she's using was really important to this video it was sent to me and it is really amazing so let's go on into the next day so here's me the next day with my hair all flat ironed and so overall, the flat iron did a really great job. It's just that I somehow sweat in my sleep and I now I need to retouch. So the flat iron is by Remington and it is their T-Studio Protect flat iron and it has vapor infusion technology, which I thought was really, really cool. I'll talk more about it later on, but it just has ceramic plates, one inch, and of course it heats up in like 30 seconds, you guys. And the um, buttons and everything are really simple. It just has a on button and then it has a minus and plus sign which can make the temperature go up to as high as 450 degrees which is what I used the first night but for me showing you me retouching my hair I'm just going to be using three buttons which is probably about 300 degrees or something like that. So this area here that I'm showing you now is where the actual magic of the vapor fusion comes to life. So basically you just take this little cartridge and you just open the flap and it comes with this macadamia conditioning treatment and it's pretty liquidy, very liquidy. It's almost like water so if you don't want to use the macadamia treatment you can also put distilled water in here but it has to be like distilled. It can't be like tap water. So you just pour it in the cartridge and then you just seal it back up and you stick it back into your flat iron. So to activate the vapor infusion, all you have to do is to activate this, all you have to do is press the blue button. It's like the only button on the front of the flat iron and it's just going to blink until it's ready. So then I just go ahead and I just touch up my hair in a bat because for some reason I sweat a lot that night. Like I wish I didn't wrap my hair because whenever I wrap my hair, I just it just doesn't work out. So my hair stays straighter when I don't wrap it. Isn't that weird? So I just touch up my roots and everything and go through the back of the hair and you can kind of see the steam from the flat iron. No, my hair isn't burning. It's just the steam coming out of the flat iron. So right here, I was just trying to show you how much movement my hair has had. I could never get this result with my old flat iron at all. Like I never could, but you can see like it just has so much more movement to it and I'm just so pleased with the way it turned out. I wore my hair straight for like two weeks, but of course, for some reason my hair reverts really fast at the roots and everything so I was not able to keep it straight that long especially with the fact that I go to Zumba and I work out on a daily basis throughout the week so yeah. Also the night before when my friend actually flat ironed it for me after she got finished I went ahead and trimmed my ends myself and I just knocked some dead ends off and stuff tried to get rid of as many split ends as I could. But just retouching my hair, you can see how much straighter and flatter this side is versus the other side. I was just really pleased with my hair. It had a lot of movement and I enjoyed the results until it got really, really hard to maintain. And I did a bunch of styles with it. So I'm very pleased with this flat iron and the results that it gave my hair.